Hey everyone, in this video, I'm going to share with you three of the most effective ways that you can use to leverage the digital age. Given the restrictions imposed on physical interaction due to the COVID-19 pandemic, digitalization is now more important than ever. In fact, it has become a necessity. So how do you leverage the digital economy for your advantage? Well, the answer is through data, transparency and influences. Now, let me show you how each one of these can improve the way you do business. Let's start with leveraging data. Data analytics is fundamental to many businesses and using what you know about your target market can prove valuable by millions of billions from a monetary perspective. Let's use one example. Take Sephora for instance. Now this French multinational retail chain that sells personal care and beauty products was one of the first companies in the industry that really understood the true power of data. They track data from customer in-store purchases, interactions with in-store salespeople, and online browsing and purchasing patterns. And then they develop tools to provide a more customer-centric experience. Now these tools included Virtual Artists, which is essentially an app powered by augmented reality that allows people to try on cosmetics virtually. And number two, Color Match, which essentially assists customers in identifying the shades suitable for their skin tone based on an uploaded photo. Now, all these innovations were driven by data. Number two, let's move on to leveraging transparency. You see, according to studies, 73% of consumers are willing to pay more for a product sold by a company that demonstrates transparency but 21% more of them will be loyal to a business that offers transparency. Can you imagine the revenue you can generate from 94% of your consumer base simply by being transparent? Now combine this with open communication and the rewards will be truly astounding. Let me give you one example. A perfect example is the online store Patagonia that sells a range of products from clothes to toys. They have a project called Footprint Chronicles that shows videos of their product supply chain and how each item sold reaches your door without causing any harm to the environment. Now, did it work for them? See, in 2019, Patagonia's e-commerce net sales alone were valued over 396 million US dollars. I can say that is a huge success. Number three, we're on to the last part now. Leveraging influencers. In Asia, influencer marketing is the most cost-effective channel to acquire customers these days. In fact, for every $1 invested in micro-influencers, a business in Asia can literally generate over $6.50 on average. This is how amazing influencers can be. Automobile manufacturer Buick recognized the power of influencer marketing which is why they used it as a micro strategy. Now, through a campaign on Pinterest called Pinboard to Dashboard, the company generated over 17 million unique visitors and followers, not just on Pinterest, but also on Facebook, on Instagram, and on Twitter. With the right influencers who can authentically connect with your target market and effectively share your brand's messaging for you, you'll soon be reaching and engaging an audience far bigger than ever before. I hope you gain valuable insights from this video and you will use the tips I've shared to carve out your own path in the digital age. This is Mario signing off. I'll see you in the next video. Hi, thank you so much for watching this video. To get access to more high quality videos that's going to supercharge and fast track your business, do click on the subscribe button below. Also, don't forget to click the notification bell so that you'll be the first to know when I upload all these videos. I'll see you in the next video.